Welcome to Excel with Mark and today we're going to be looking at what we call operators within Excel. So we have addition, subtraction, division and multiplication which we use within different sums to get different answers. So we have addition, subtraction, division and multiplication. To use these within any sum what we do is we need to click into a box and press the equals with a sum function. We can then do an open bracket like so and then we can click or type a number. So if we were to refer to a cell, we could click onto the cell. Or for now, just for ease, we'll type in a number. Place in the 4. And then to bring up the plus or the addition symbol, we can press the shift. And then if you look where the backspace is, you're looking for the key that's just to the left of that with a plus. Again, we can type in a number with a closed bracket. And we can see that we have that there. So we have the 4 plus 4, which gives us the 8. Using the same sum again, we can do the um, subtraction. So we have the 4, and then again next to the plus you have the minus. This time you don't have to press the shift though, just press that little line, and that will give you the subtraction sign, and then 4 again. Working on the division now, we have the sum, and again we can do the 4, and then the forward slash. So for the forward slash, we can have this if you look towards where your right shift key is. To the left of that, the same key that has the question mark on, that should be your division. Pressing the 4, close brackets to give us the 1. And then for the last one, then the multiplication. Again, we have to hold shift for this one. So we're going to hold shift and it should be the number 8 that you press to give you that multiplication. Times that by 4, close brackets gives us 16. And we can see if we open up all the different formulas at that point that we have all the different operators and how they all work all there. So we have the plus, the minus, the division and the multiplication. All there giving us all the different answers that we need. Hope that helps. Thanks a lot for watching and we'll see you again soon.